This is Brian Charles, and I'm here to introduce you to LightGrid, a script I wrote that controls sets of lights as a group. Install LightGrid on your system in the Script UI Panels folder. Install both the JSX bin file and the folder called LightGrid. Once installed, the script is available from the Window menu and comes up as a dockable panel. To use LightGrid, select your composition, choose the light type, number of lights, and how you want them arranged, and then click Make Grid. Lights are generated as numbered sets, and spotlights come in with both a spotlight controller and a POI control, which I'll get to in a minute. Selecting the spotlight controller reveals all of the effects controls for that group of lights. So you can control brightness, shadow darkness, diffusion, color, rotation angle, position offset, spread, which is the distance between the lights, so they can get very close together or very far apart, uh, whether they have a common POI or not, and again, I'll get that to that in a minute, uh, using a POI offset and adjust the cone angle and cone feather, which can create some very interesting looks. Lights can be arranged in a circle as well, just to give a different look. And when they're in a circle, distance between the lights is controlled by adjusting radius. Clicking the POI checkbox has all the lights face the POI control, which can now be manipulated directly in the composition. Multiple light sets can be combined in a single composition to create different looks. Using a grid of lights on Ray Trace 3D can enhance the appearance of volume on extruded objects and produce some gorgeous shading. By setting the total brightness to a negative value, you can selectively remove light from an area of your scene. Anyway, that's LightGrid. You can download it here from the Creative Cal, free of charge. No warranties expressed or implied. I hope you enjoy using it. Thank you.